Welcome to this short video on using a new feature of Trilio for OpenStack to easily migrate VMware virtual machines into OpenStack. In this video, I'll demonstrate how we migrate a couple of CentOS VMs to my Red Hat OpenStack platform cluster. Trilio for OpenStack integrates directly into the Horizon experience. And from here, we can launch the VMware migration plugin to create a migration plan. A migration plan is where you determine which VMs to include in your migration to the current operating tenant we're in. In this case, I'll select these two CentOS VMs. Once selected, I press the Discover VMs menu action button. This then retrieves further information about the chosen VMs like IP address, network, storage. Once discovered, I start the migration process. I can perform different types of migrations from here. In this case, I'm doing a cold migration, which means it will shut down the VMs in VMware before getting the contents of the disks to convert for use within OpenStack on our chosen storage. Alternative migration strategies are dry run, which will copy the contents of the running VM in VMware without impact, but create the test VM in OpenStack. This of course is useful for testing purposes, allowing you to help size and plan your migrations effectively. And warm migration, which will do multiple incremental copies, allowing the VM to remain online for longer whilst we copy the Delta changes over into OpenStack. Network mapping maps VM vSwitch adapter NICs to OpenStack networks. If my VMs have multiple NICs, I can map them here. For storage, a similar process where my disks are stored on data stores in VMware, I need to map them to my available storage in OpenStack. In this case, I'm choosing Ceph. Finally, I can select which VMs to bring over. In this example, I selected two VMs, so I'll include them both. When mapping flavors, how resources are assigned in OpenStack, like CPU, RAM, and boot disk size, Trilio automatically chooses the closest available flavor present in OpenStack for use by that VM. But you are, of course, free to change this here before the migration begins. The migration phase will now start. Now, after a short while, the migration will have completed successfully and the VMs will have started up in OpenStack ready for use. Thank you for watching this short video on easy migrations of VMware VMs into OpenStack with Trilio for OpenStack. For more information, visit trilio.io.